Hi folks, we are, oh, right, we'll do it again. Hi folks, Nathaniel here. We are in Dallas. We are at the Dallas International Guitar Show. It is very hot outside, so let's get inside because we actually have a booth. There's a couple of people at the booth, so we're gonna check out some amazing guitars. Come follow me. Here we are. Oh look, look at these two characters. What are you doing here? They printed this upside down. Ah! Oh. I'm delighted to be here. Uh, I love Dallas. I think it's my second time here. Uh, I did have a beef rib before I got on stage. It may affect the performance. Thank you very much. Oh, wow. Wow. It's spotless, isn't it? Pick it up if you want, it's pretty light. Is that, is that okay? I'll be careful, don't worry. I thought it was going to be like a brick. Yeah. That's, yeah. Wow. Wow. That's gorgeous. Yeah, it's a good one. It's, it's all the hot. It's never make it cap. Yeah, yeah, because wow. it's painted all black, they can put a, a maple cap on it. So it's all mahogany. That is beautiful. So, as you can imagine, there is an enormous amount of guitars here. So, but here are some of the ones that we've bought and are going to be at the store soon and they could be yours. Gorgeous telly, look at that. Big fan of that, 70s telly. Got a cool Hackstrom here. Really like this. That's cool. Really like that. Again, these are gonna be yours soon. We're gonna be doing some demos on them as well. So, as I said, there is thousands of guitars here. So let's check out what we can find, I suppose. Let's go. So Nathaniel, yes. how would you rate the accuracy of the evening? Obviously you're an expert in these matters since yeah. it's, I imagine this was pretty much like what high school was like. I could give him a few tips. You know, we, we did a lot of jazz sense. We did a lot of jazz in, in secondary school. Yeah. A few little tips I'd give them. The swordsmanship was so-so, okay. right? The chicken leg was pretty good though. Yeah? That's Not good. Bad, right? How would you rate the, uh, the accents? Authentic? No, I'll, get, I'll give him a 5 out of 10. <laughs> so I've seen you looking. I've seen you having up there. Hands. Reenact the handshake. It's happening. I'm such a fan. I'm going to get out of my room. Hey, buddy, how are you? Good to see you. Oh, this is a baritone? Oh, yeah. <laughs>
sounded good. Yeah, that sounds good. Yeah, it sounds good. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> That way. Firstly, I need that melody note, um, the, uh, as well as the kind of descend and bass line. Uh, so if I was to kind of slow that down and try and play it a different way, I could maybe try this instead. Notice I'm in a very uncomfortable position here with my thumb, okay, my first finger. That is not comfortable. Uh, you're going to do some damage if you hold that for too long. So, uh, so you kind of have to do a little bit of trial and error. It's almost like a problem solving to an extent. So, and I want that note to ring out as well. I don't want it to be just. And notice my thumb just kind of playing that bass line at the same time.
course, we are here at the Dallas International Guitar Show. Some amazing guitars here. We're still trying to find some more. Loads of booths, loads of interesting things, and we're gonna just take a little walk. Now, funnily enough, so the head buying team at the shop, Daniel S. Cruiser, Dan Lump, they're hard at work. They're here somewhere doing a lot of work, looking for guitars that hopefully you're gonna buy, a lot of vintage guitars. And we're gonna see some more. He's taking the piss, isn't he? That's, but does the boss know about this? Uh, uh, Look, uh, <laughs> he just woke up. I tell you, I'll, I'll take it from here. <laughs> <I'll t> <laughs> 